to sort of speak to the people who are maybe in the midpoint between K and gray. Um, uh, what, you know, if you're studying for the cert and you want to get the cert, but you want to make sure you're not just, you know, collecting certs, what are some tips you might have to get the hands-on skills that you're looking for? I mean, again, is, does Cyber Patriot have that sort of, uh, you know, these sort of hands-on type things that you can work with or do you have other suggestions? Oh, sure. I mean, so make, make sure you join the, uh, the Information Security Professional Organizations, ISSA. Right. Uh, make sure you're, you're part of your B-size communities. Uh, go to uh, those, um, I, I don't want to use the term hacker, but in San Antonio, we have the San Antonio Hacker uh, Association. Okay. And then we have other uh, groups that are all coalesced together. At our universities, they have a lot of student-led organizations that are under the tutelage of associate professors and deans uh, mm -hmm. at the University of uh, North, at the University of Texas San Antonio. Dr. Nicole Beebe is is world renowned as a digital forensics uh, expert and subject matter leader, and she has been leading the the cybersecurity student association there and helping them as they are going through their undergraduate and graduate programs. And in some cases, uh, the students are so proficient, they even pursue their doctorate. So you know, it's a really about, um, if you're a middle-aged professional today, and we're dealing with all of these uncertainties, the way to uh, get away from uncertainty is to have some vision and the inspiration as to you know, where you want to go and then link up with those who are already there, the digital natives, right. and say, hey, look, um, hey, I've been a, a office administrator and I've been dealing with personnel records. Uh, how can I leverage my understanding of human resources management with information security? And then that's a great inroad to talk about identity access management and maybe your interest in becoming a certified um, technician in that space. New episodes of CyberWork are available every Monday at 1 p.m. Central. And don't forget to claim your free month of InfoSec skills. Sign up using the code CyberWork and you'll get unlimited access to hundreds of courses, hands-on labs, certification practice exams, skills assessments, and more. Use code CyberWork for InfoSec skills.